What's up everybody, my name is Coalfire and welcome back to Hollow Knight. So, we're done with the White Palace. I can't say that I'm sad about being finished with that hellhole, but I may have been a little harsh on it in the last episode. That's okay. Emotions happen. They're human. But we, um, we need to go get the other half of charm that we picked up and that is over in the queen's gardens so let's head over there and uh i guess get ready to finish this game man i do not want this shit to end absolutely oh. <laughs> goddamn microphone's in the way <laughs> Well, what uh, charms do I have on right now? Ah. Well, I will change those later. Actually, I kind of need them now. Well, that works. That should do us just dandy now that we can actually see ourselves. I was talking to a couple people on uh, Reddit last night about the White Palace and apparently having Quick Slash on and doing sword jumps in a lot of those areas helps considerably. But I honestly never think to do. Oh, excuse me. I never think to do sword jumps unless it's like the only way to get through something. gate that's about to pop up right there. What's in here? Oh, just another big old mantis fight. Execution. Okay. <clears throat> so, how does that link in to... I am really curious about the lore. And maybe in the last episode, I'll uh, do a bit more research onto the story of this game and talk about it. Because I'm assuming either this episode or the next episode are going to be the last.
There's a grub in here. Where are you, grub? Why can I hear you but not see you? That's weird. Sorry, dude. What is this place? It's like the exact opposite of the abyss. Whoa. Oh, one arrives. Far it walks to find me. Did it seek my aid, or did the path carry it by chance to so pertinent a place? It is true, true that you were awaited. No, perhaps that is inaccurate. True, one like you was awaited. I have a gift, long held for one of your kind, half of a whole, when united, great power is granted, and on the path ahead, great power it will need. There it is. King Saul. It faced the gendered child. She's a fierce foe, strong in mind and body, striking reflection of her mother. Though the two were permitted little time together. I was never begrudged by the worm's alliance's bargain. In fact, I feel some affection for the creature's birth. If your paths were ever to align, I imagine you might gain yourself a powerful ally. Are you talking about Hornet? Merma. Within my roots, the weakening of the vessel, I plainly feel. Only two obvious outcomes there are from such a thing. The first is inevitable on current course. Regression. All minds relinquish to that pernicious plague. The second I find preferable and would seek your aid in its occurrence. Replacement. I implore you, usurp the vessel. Its supposed strength was ill-judged. It was tarnished by an idea instilled. But you, you are free of such blemishes. You could contain that thing inside. Merma. I'll offer fair warning. The vessel itself may be weak, but it is much empowered by that force within. To claim its role requires strength of some magnitude. Prepare yourself before attempting the task. Pianeros. Ah, so it bears our once fractured soul now complete. Such strength, such resolve, such dedication. It is more than simply a vessel. I almost feel I am once again in the presence of my beloved worm. The king soul. Was it at the heart of it, I wonder? If its curiosity wills it, it should seek out that place. That place where it was born. Where it died. Where it began. Yep, that's where we're headed next. Um, yep. <clears throat> that is where we are headed. The birthplace. How do I save you, little man? All right, well. I guess we're going, uh, deep back down into the depths. I'll see you there. 
Welcome back to the ancient basin. We are headed far down below. Let us put on our new soul. I don't want to combine you with the focus. All right, let's get moving. There's something there. I thought something popped up when I came by here. No? Oh yeah, a King Soul um, gives you 2% of your soul per second, I think, or per tick, and I'm not sure what that tick is. Alright, let's um, just pop over, I don't know, ow, yep, mistake. Here we are. A deep blue stone atop a dais. So what do I, what do, I do with you? Let's just head further down. Ow. Ow, you bastard. At least I am not wanting for soul right now. Nice. will cry out again. Is that all you got? That's just creepy.
Nice. <laughs> oh. Did not see you. All this makes you wonder how long this has been going on. Whoa. Oh, dude. That's a really nice little touch. Um No cost too great. Um It's so much darker down here now. Okay, this isn't the same area. Do I just need to go up? talking about us, aren't we? Really getting into that whole, like, player-controlled idea. No voice to cry suffering. Born of God and void. Shall seal the binding light that plagues their dreams. You are the vessel. You are the hollow night. Okay.
Okay. Just nothing now. guys just like passive now and you die in one hit oh yeah you guys don't hurt any ow anymore <laughs> very cool Okay, so that's how that works. Oh, cool. Whoa, whoa, okay. Guess I just needed enough lifeblood then. Fucking, like, lifeblood core or something? Don't know why I'm here or what I'm doing, but I'm strangely okay with it. Uh, 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 oh, oh, okay, I guess that works. Does the lifeblood just refill in here? Okay, we gotta... Oh, man! That sucks. Burb. egg. That's nice and all. I haven't that much need for the mun muns lately. Lifeblood core. So 
So what do you do? <coughs> okay. So I just spent about 30 minutes in the Colosseum of Fools in an attempt to draw out enough content to make this an entire episode without ending the game. And I realized that I wasn't cool with that because I was just trying to buy time and it wasn't good content for you guys and I just, I don't want to do shit like that. But I also really don't want this series to end. I love this game so much and this game's been uh, a series on the channel for about half the life of the channel thus far. And, uh, I don't know. I guess I'm, I just wasn't really ready to throw in the towel yet on Hollow Knight. And, uh, I decided that would just kind of be disrespectful to the series and to you guys, so... What do you say we go finish this game? Oh, perfect. Absolutely perfect. All right, where the fuck are we going? Oh, well, just straight over here then. Back to where it all began, I guess. Temple of the Black Egg. I'm impressed, little ghost. You've burdened yourself with the fate of this world, yet still stands strong. To break the dreamer's seals would be a, would alone be considered an impossible task, but to accept that void inside yourself that casts you as something rather exceptional. Hakana Sagamos. Oh, I can't I can't look up. I was gonna try and give her a kiss. Vessel, though bound, you shall know the state of the world. Hollow Nest will be whole again.
there, bro. Yeah, I don't really know what else I expected. I mean, he's the true fucking final boss. The path is opened. One way or another, an end waits inside. I won't be joining you in this. That space is built to sustain your likes. Its bindings would drain me were I to join. Don't be surprised. I'll not risk my own life in your attempt, though if the moment presents, I'll aid as I'm able.
Oh, <laughs> awesome. Okay, so I went off and I earned the last charm notch super quick. Um, yeah, let's try this. Okay, so, having a hard time with that fight. So, um, I was going off and I was doing shit while my face cam was rendering and ended up doing a bunch of stuff that I, I thought you guys would end up liking to see. And now I feel bad for doing that, for trying to power up the fight. So I'm kind of all over the place, and I'm running out of time in the day. So I figured, why not finish off the episode by uh, trying to collect a couple of extra grubs so we can get some tail ore to um, get the ultimate nail upgrade and uh, have a little easier time with that fight. So let's go do that. It also means we get to fight the mini boss and um, head up into the Tower of Love. Which, if you remember coming through here, Tower of Love is up through here, but you can't access it from this side. Yeah, it's right in here. So, we have to go around. Doing a good job of, I think. game and then uh, backing out of that fight but god damn that's a hard fight so yeah let's, uh... but I guess the thing with that was I was Originally, just kind of going out of my way to try and create some filler content to extend the episode. But I ended up doing a bunch of other stuff that I feel like should have been in an episode. And I still had some stuff left to do. I'm getting powered up and whatnot. So I figured, well, let's, let's just fucking... Yeah, let's do that. I'm a little sleepy if you guys... Love key. I don't even remember when we found it. I remember picking it up.
fucking like you. You're kind of a ridiculous super goof, but... It's definitely a change of pace. Sorry, I need your map. <laughs> wow. Okay, I was a little creepy. Collector's map. We can see all the imprisoned grubs we have left now. Okay, so there's one here. Show me the full map. Oh, so can I only see them in the area that I'm in? Oh no, there's some more. Okay, so there, 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 all right, well, I'm going to run back to, uh, Grubfather, and see if those three were enough piece of pale ore. Because I think we're close. Is there a switch around here somewhere? There it is. Awesome! Now those doors are open. Oh, is this it? Yeah. Okay, so that means we have one piece left. And, uh... So, Ancient Basin, Hollow Nest's Crown... I got the one in Colosseum of Fools, I got the one from the Seer, I got the one from Grubfather. We got the one in Ancient Basin, didn't we? Let's see. Yeah, I've got two. I need one more for the uh, last upgrade. Well, I suppose we can just go look at each area. Maybe it's the one in Ancient Basin we haven't gotten yet.
from the reading that I was doing in uh, trying to figure out what I needed to do to power up a wee bit. I did um, stumble across the ending to the Nailsmith's quest, and it's uh, just kind of sad. I mean, it's kind of cool in its own way, but yeah, we'll see soon enough. Probably spoiled too much already. Jeez, is everything infected now? What the fuck was that noise? Oh, what's up, Cloth? My friend, you dealt with all those beasts? I'm ashamed to say I was hiding. Those ghastly things chased me and I ran. If you hadn't come along, who knows if I'd ever survived. Others take me for a fearsome warrior with my impressive size, but this kingdom's beasts. I wonder if I'm just no match for them. Aha! Bakusa! Enough! I cannot wallow in my weakness. I must take strength from your example. You act so confident in battle. You show your you show no fear before your foes. I'll try my best to do the same. Thus, Manulan. I look forward to our next contact, tiny savior. Then you'll meet a warrior with courage to match your own. Cloth, I like you. I really like you. Oh, I shot the wrong way. Is that it? There it is. That's the one we hadn't picked up. Free. All right, let's um, go get ourselves the best nail that we can get. I think we have enough money for it, don't you think? See you there. Here we are. You. Necessary damage. All right. Perfect nail time. Hey, Andre. Ah, Ranjo Stenja. Hmm. So you returned. I see you have some pale ore. A rare, fine material that. Give me the ore and some geo for my efforts, and I'll reforge your nail to make it stronger. Wow, I didn't think it was going to be that much. Jonsha. As you wish, I'll get to work then. Garadel Akari. It is done. The reforging is complete. 
Your nail is much stronger than it used to be, as strong as it could ever be. In only your weapon have I seen potential. Finally, I behold the majesty of a pure nail. To think this moment has come upon me so soon. I... I must step outside a moment. Jeez, you're huge. Ah, Ranjo Stenja. With a pure nail forged, my work in this lifetime comes to an end. My only remaining desire is to see and feel the nail strike true. I beg you, cut me down. It's my final moment in life. I want to taste the blade's exquisite edge. After all this time, all this toil, haven't I earned it? Dude. Dude. Ah. Oh. No. Oh, man. Andre. Oh, no. Don't bring the music back. God damn it. <laughs> oh, you motherfucker. Man. I liked him. Well, I put it to the best use possible. The next episode will be the last, no matter what it takes. Man, Andre, it wasn't even your name. That's what I called you. This is Andre the Blacksmith from Dark Souls. <sighs> yeah, I mean, I guess that's a fitting penultimate episode. Trying and failing, going to a dear friend, having him create his masterwork, us taking his life out of respect for him. Yeah. Oh, Hollow Knight, why must you end? Why must you make me love you so? <sighs> Thank you guys so much for watching. My name is Coal Fire, and I will see you next time.